Max. You waving, Max? <sighs> like Merida, yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Boo.
I am currently walking to the Magic Kingdom on our final day. We fly home today. We're being picked up at 2.30. It is currently 8.30 in the morning and I'm zipping into Magic Kingdom and I'm currently on the phone to Joel. It doesn't look like it because I've had to put my coffee on my phone to film this, but Joel is there. Say hi, Joel. Hello. There we go. Um, Hello, so that is the plan this morning. This is actually a really nice little walk. I've never done this. I'm walking from the Grand Floridian to the Magic Kingdom. Um, anyone who stays in a Disney hotel gets early access this morning. The park should open at nine, but I can get in at 8.30. Um, so I've got a couple bits and pieces to get. That's the reason I'm going in, is because I wanted to get something yesterday and the, oh, I'm very bright at the moment. Ooh. Oh well, you just have to deal with me being a ghost because I've got no hands left to press buttons. There was a couple things I wanted to get yesterday and couldn't get them because the shop closed before we left the park. So I'm gonna need to do that this morning. I'm gonna try and ride the Haunted Mansion one last time as well. Say bye, Joel. Bye, Carrie. Into the Magic Kingdom, one last time we go. This is where you go for early entry. I've got to scan my magic wand just so they know I'm staying in a Disney hotel. Hi. Just one. Thank you very much. Thank you. I'm in. So that's the line there where everyone who is staying outside of Disney property gets kept that side. Everyone who has early entry comes in this side who's staying on property at Disney. Um, and then, yeah. There's a little welcome show that um, starts just before the park opens at 8.55. Um, but I have stuff to do, so unless I accidentally manage to catch it, I'm just gonna go and carry on doing what I'm doing. Um, and then dart back to my family and might be, able, might be able just to make breakfast with them, if I'm lucky. Or I get myself a funnel cake here, either or. Look how pretty the castle is. Rookie mistake, but I've just realized it's the part of the park that I want actually isn't open right now. So I might as well just go and watch the opening show and then dart in to Adventureland, Frontierland, Adventureland, that's what I need. I'm gonna do that, but first I'm gonna get a Cheshire Cat Tail. One of the things I've not really had a chance to talk about whilst I'm here is the fact that I got engaged the day, two days before I left to come here. Joel obviously wanted to propose to me before I went away for two weeks, which is understandable, but then it also means that we got engaged. The following day we both had two shows, me at Chalk Circle, him at Hamilton, so we didn't see each other really, and that was also my birthday. And then I flew to Disney World the following day, so we've had like no time just being an engaged couple. Which is really weird when you're then in like a really romantic, inspiring, happy place that we both love so much. So it's just been this really <laughs> overwhelming feeling of like, knowing that I'm engaged but the person I'm engaged to isn't here to share this amazing space with me. Um, but I guess it means going home is going to be... I've got something to look forward to going home to, you know what I mean? Usually leaving Disney it's like, no I don't want to go, but this time I'm like, my new fiance is at home waiting for me, so... Okay, how are we looking? Am I going to get on this or is it already like a crazy wait? It looks like a crazy wait. Let me see what it's saying. If I can't get on it, it's okay. What we're saying, what we're saying, what we're saying. Oh, it's not saying anything. Sod it, let's just get on and see what happens. That part of the queue isn't open, sadly. Sad times, sad times. Okay, I've done Haunted and now I'm on a mission. And I couldn't say it before because I was on FaceTime to Joel, but I'm off to get his birthday present. Um, he mentioned a while ago that he'd broken his Ray-Bans. Um, his, I think they're Wayfarer, that's the theme. They look like Blues Brothers ones. Um, and I spotted that they do some really nice Mickey Mouse ones here, like special fancy Disney ones here. And I had a look online, you can only get them here. Um, or like in the US. I wouldn't be able to get them when I go home. So I'm heading to the Sunglass Hut, because Magic Kingdom very handily has a Sunglass Hut. So I'm heading there and I'm gonna 
nab them for him because Joel is one of those people whose birthdays is annoyingly close to Christmas. Uh, his birthday is January 10th for anyone who wants to know. Um, so I need to get it sorted because over Christmas I'm very busy with Panto so I, uh, I might as well get it done now. Birthday present sorted. Birthday present acquired. Done and dusted. Say bye Disney. Thanks for a great trip. Bye. Thank you.